100 Russian viewers of this video, и добро пожаловать на канал Инновации Redstone. Hello, viewers of this video, and welcome back to the Redstone Innovation channel. Uh, big shout out to all of our Russian fans. Um, all right, so today we've got a bit of a modification on that video we released yesterday, which we might actually take down. Um, I don't know, it really depends, but anyways. Um, today we sped up this door. Uh, that we released yesterday S still has the same size but we sped it up um, due to this fancy piston here and we also made it oh great okay uh, we, we made uh, made it save two redstone because of this uh, a piston only needs one redstone and a repeater needs three so um, uh, yeah this saves you two redstone let's just show you in action as you can see, uh, another thing that's uh, good about using this piston here is that when a piston is powered, it does not cause any updates. However, when it when it retracts, um, which it will when you power this lever because this torch will turn off, when it retracts, the the piston base will cause an update to this torch and set off the double extender. So there is no cooldown time when you close the door to when you are able to open it. So I uh, like that. The double extender works the same. Can you make it day, please? No. But as you can see, when you close the door, the double extender does not fire. Which is awesome. Oh. Wow. Okay. Sorry. Um. And the door fixes itself. Yeah. <laughs> uh. We don't advertise that as a feature, though. <laughs> so don't go spamming levers. Alright, but now the main focus of this video is that we made a brand new door and this door we hope will blow your minds as well because what bam this door is <laughs> measures in 9 by 10 which makes it incredibly 90 blocks volume <laughs> so this door we cut a block off the height and this door then is 90 blocks in volume, making it the most compact 3x3 door in the world of Minecraft, known to man. Um, now the double extender on this thing is a bit of a mystery, um, but it does work pretty reliably based on our testing. So let's just show you it in action. It closes up in a spiral kind of motion that wasn't really by choice, but now we've made it a feature. <laughs> and then when you open it up, the double extender spazzes out much more than the other one. However, it does work uh, very reliably in our testing. So yeah, um, awesome stuff. Uses the new redstone block. And yeah, so if you uh, cover this door up, then you can see that it does indeed close in a spiral action. Um, this lamp indicates when this lamp is uh, flickering, that means you cannot open the door. Because uh, the torch, otherwise, yeah, because the torch was updated for some reason, and the double extender was spazzing or something. Well, if you want to implement that lamp into your door, then go ahead and make it three times bigger by adding this <laughs> little thing. Oh, my bad. Uh, like this, <laughs> and then place lamp. Right on this torch, and it's can be flush with the floor, and uh, it's gonna get all nice and good. So yeah, so if we go ahead and update the torch now, uh, the uh, lamp will start to flicker and tell you that you cannot operate the door. Um, now, <laughs> uh. So this is also a one wide design, so there will be no tutorial. You can you can look at it and get all the timings from there, the timings and the layout of everything. Um, so let's just go ahead, go over each piece. Um, this repeater is optional, but it adds to the spiral effect. Um, going down is the double extender, redstone block. Going down, the blah, the blah, the blah. Looks like that. So yeah. Um, Hope you guys enjoyed. I think that's it. Oh, uh, right. One last thing. We like to call this the Zeus door because <laughs> it looks like this door has been split diagonally from top to bottom uh, 
just like if you look at it you can see straight through the door and it looks like it's separated into two different parts so yeah yeah is that it I believe so other than this door has just under I'm pretty sure under 10 air blocks which <laughs> then if you're smart enough you can utilize to make it even smaller than 90 if that's you, my theory. If you really think that's possible. Alright, so this has been the Redstone Innovation Channel. Hope you guys enjoyed. As always, we thank you for watching. If you're new to the channel, make sure to check out our past stuff. Rate, comment, subscribe, and all that cool stuff. And we'll see you guys next time. Hui. Blah! Hui. <laughs> <laughs>